one of my comments was to try and go a little bit longer. So let's hit the start button, shall we? Today I wanted to talk to you a little bit about brown fat. So along with many of the health benefits to walking in cold, exposing yourself to cold is the fact that you will increase your brown fat. So brown fat can be found around your organs. Um, children, babies are born with brown fat. That's what keeps them warm. They're born without clothes, of course. We've lost a lot of our brown fat because we uh, wear clothes. So the whole idea is to increase the brown fat. And you do this by exposing yourself to cold. And of course, the longer that you can go, the more brown fat you'll build up. So I'm going to try and go a, a little bit longer. And uh, I know I'm going a little slower. And I uh, thought I'd talk to you about this brown fat. How am I doing? We're at, uh, that's one minute. <laughs> okay, I'll try and go back again. Yeah, I'm picking up my speed a little bit. Anyways, brown fat is uh, amazing. So it'll actually keep you warmer in the winter. So the more brown fat, it's sort of like the healthy fat. You've got your white fat and your brown fat, but your brown fat is healthy fat. So you want to build up your healthy fat. So this is what I'm doing. I've been doing this for a bit and you do it because it feels really good. You'll notice the difference. I notice the difference. I notice the difference if I don't do cold exposure and I'm trying to do it with walking in the snow through the winter and also I'm doing the uh, cold showers as well. So we are at uh, one, two minutes. So that's it. One. Two minutes is more than enough. Cold shower day keeps the doctor away. Now we're preparing the ice bath. Man is there. Right up. Yeah, yeah right up. Boy. 10 minutes, 24. He was it. Oh, amazing. People who have amazing. panic attacks, anxiety, trauma, it's great to learn to overcome anxiety, yeah. panicking, and all that.